pH here. I'm back at the pond. I came here a couple days ago and it was iced over. It rained like crazy and was like 40 degrees almost. So I came back and it looks like a little bit has opened. So I'm going to give it a go. The only thing I brought here, guys, are two different types of Zoom flukes. These are the seven inch ones. So I'm going to try these out. I didn't bring nothing else. Let's see if we could nab anything. See if there's any beauties out there. Maybe they ain't popping these things. That one popped. We can get them up. <laughs> Just as I say, they ain't popping these things. A nab one. <laughs> McNasty. Hold on, you jumping bean. Oh, they're cold as hell. Oh, I got them good. <laughs> right there. Check out that beauty. Let's let them go. If there's any paupers out there. All right. I'm gonna try something here. Rig one of these up on a jig head. That's all I brought. Where are they? Brought some of these quarter ounce fish head. So let's try one of those. Try one of these bad boys. I'm just gonna hook this up in here. This will be that'll be far enough up in the bait. Let me clip some off this beginning part here. Clip some off here. I could pass it straight through. Now, let me see. Yeah, I could probably. Let me try it like this. Kind of rigging it like a worm hook. There you go. Just like that. Let's see how she goes. Alright, I rigged that beauty up on a jig head. Let's try it out. Oh, it casts far. I don't even know if it's ice down there. Soon find out, but don't sink to the bottom. Or if I get stuck on ice, that'll really stink. I don't know if that was on ice. Yep. Oh, lucky I didn't get caught through it.
Oh, oh yeah. So nailed it. Come in, baby. Oh, he's pulling like a bitch. Not too big of one either, but he's pulling strong. He's a puller. He's a puller. He like that. Come here, you little bugger. Stop your flapping. Hooey, he liked this. That setup worked like a beauty. Let's let this bugger go. Thanks for biting. That bomb's out there really far. Just look at how far that cast with this gliss line. 12 pound. Alright guys, I've been fishing for a while now. You can see the ice went further back. I ain't getting nothing else, so I'm going to try to change the appearance of this. I'm going to use this marker here to spike it. I'm going to try to make it yellow just by going like this on it. You can see it changes the color. So I'm going to do this. And we'll see what happens because the bite's non-existent right now. This is an old marker. I need to get a new one. And you can see the difference. That side. Or that side. So I'm going to do it up and try it out all right there's the appearance now so we're gonna give this a go and see what happens not even the color change is helping guys well I fished with this for a while now. The color change didn't help. So I'm going to try to baby bass color for a little bit and see what happens. Alrighty. I got the baby bass color on. I'm going to give that a whirl. I ain't getting nothing since them ones I caught. The ice just melted away and I got nothing. I'm trying everything. I'm getting crap. <clears throat> Trying every type of cast, every type of movement. There just ain't nothing popping no more. Alrighty. I'm trying everything. I'm trying to move the floor fast, twitching it slow. Nothing's working. All right, guys, that's it for me. This is the fluke challenge. At least I got something in the winter time on those seven inch flukes. You usually have to use a small bait. I fished for a while longer. As you can see, the ice is gone now over here and it's only over there and in the back. But at least I got something better than nothing. Guys, thanks for watching my videos. I appreciate it as always. Hit that thumbs up if you can for me and leave a comment. It'll be awesome. And PH, I'll see you next time on the water. Zzz.